hi everyone welcome back to my channel in this video i'll be talking about how to create this kind of flip card effect it will flip horizontally as well as vertically i will make this card flip vertically in this code so without any delay let's jump into the code so first of all you will have to import a package for this which is flip card I will mention the package link in the description make sure like and subscribe my channel for regular updates so first of all this is my home screen you can use this kind of effect wherever you want in your project you can simply code by yourself and or you can copy paste my code so first of all this is my scaffold and inside this I have taken app bar this is the title and the background color and what i will do just inside body there is center and child of the center will be flip card this flip card widget is coming from the package that i have told you in the beginning that uh, we will install from pubdev this is flip card and it has basically two properties two required properties one is front and one is for back these two will take widget inside so first of all taken this and the first of all direction is horizontal for now by default this is horizontal and i will if you will type here vertical it will flip vertically let's move forward you can handle speed from here for now i am taking here 1000 it means one second then on flip once it will flip it will give you some value it, it will come inside this you can perform your action inside this then front in in this front i am taking card elevation of five color will be amber and padding of would be 15 and then column because for this image and these two text you can use this uh, you can use your design according to your use uh, for now i'm using here main axis minimum because i want to show my column in minimum area if you will not use this line your ui will take whole screen from start to bottom let's move forward column will take children inside first is image i'm using here asset image with a height of 200 with 200 and box width fill these are the properties of image dot asset then again i'm taking text here this is my title text and this is the subtitle text let's move forward i'm designing now back widget so it has also got back widget property inside this it will also take widget i'm taking here card elevation of five everything will be same just image content of the card will be different padding column children main exercise minimum first is image i've used a different image now i'm using here asset image you can use image network uh, and your maybe your image uh, will come from the come through api so that is why you will use here image dot network i'm using here image dot asset because i'm saving my image inside my asset folder and this is the text and this is the button like this so whenever you will flip this particular thing will happen uh, let me run this once again i think connection is lost i think let me run this once again I'm actually running it first time I think after 
booting my laptop so it may take some time you can skip this video uh, sorry skip this duration probably not skipping the video yeah you can do one thing please like and subscribe to my channel for further updates because i used to make uh, this kind of videos which is related with flutter and uh, i'm currently working on node.js so i will bring some node.js tutorial also on my youtube channel so i just want to request you please subscribe and like the video and also share the video with your friends it is installing yes it is installed so when it will flip it will come inside this and i am printing something let's see whether it is print or yes it is printing here so you can perform your action here and when i will press this button suppose if you want to navigate to some other screen for or giving the rating or performing your action you can do here if i will press this button it will print rating button it is printing here so i think this video this code is clear to you and for future purpose i am i'll be providing you the github link for this code and do one thing please subscribe and like my video and uh, yeah that's it for now hope to see you next time in our next video bye for now